Hello, Hoops fans. Welcome back to Tips and Streams, your go-to spot for all things NBA betting. As always, it's your host, Kokan, here, and I'm super excited to bring you today's jam-packed episode. We've got a thrilling lineup of today's NBA games, and I'm ready to dive deep with our predictions and insider tips. Whether you're a seasoned better or just getting into the game, today's episode is tailored just for you. Stay tuned, and let's get into today's NBA betting predictions on Tips and Streams. The first today's prediction is for a matchup between Brooklyn Nets and Philadelphia 76ers. As the Brooklyn Nets prepare to lock horns with the Philadelphia 76ers, we're on the brink of witnessing a basketball showdown filled with skillful plays and tactical maneuvers. The backdrop of Philadelphia, a city with a rich basketball legacy known for its pivotal moments, sets the stage for what appears to be a gripping contest. The Nets, currently at a 1928 record, are set to challenge the 76ers, who boast a more robust 3017 standing. The dynamic of this clash is fascinating, especially with recent performances and direct matchups taken into account. The 76ers, leveraging their home court advantage, have a slight upper hand with a field goal percentage of 47.67% against the Nets 46.11%. This shooting accuracy could play a crucial role given their nearly identical prowess from beyond the arc. Nets at 36.54%, and the 76ers just a hair's breadth away at 36.46%. Though the Nets outpace in rebounds with 45.21 per game compared to the 76ers' 42.98, Philadelphia's scoring efficiency and marginally better defense conceding 112.81 points per game to Brooklyn's 115.32 hint at a challenging face-off for the Nets. Looking at recent trends, the Nets face an uphill battle having a challenging time covering the spread in their last several games, and particularly struggling in their encounters against the 76ers. On the other hand, the 76ers have shown a solid performance at home, promising a tough game for Brooklyn. The injury report introduces additional considerations, with the Nets potentially missing critical players and the 76ers dealing with their own lineup uncertainties. This, coupled with the statistical analysis, recent forms, and head-to-head history tilts the prediction in favor of the Philadelphia 76ers. They are anticipated to not only clinch the victory, but also cover the 3.5-point spread, with the game's total points possibly falling below the anticipated margin due to significant injuries affecting both teams' scoring capabilities. Despite the Brooklyn Nets showing signs of improvement and the tight competition in three-point shooting percentages, the Philadelphia 76ers' overall efficiency and home court dominance position them as the likely victors and spread coverers. With the absence of key players possibly influencing the game's score, it's predicted to be a closely contested match, potentially not hitting the high point total expected. While I'm steering clear from betting, my forecast leans towards a 76ers victory in a closely fought battle. The next today's prediction is for the game between Golden State Warriors and Atlanta Hawks. As the Golden State Warriors gear up for a showdown with the Atlanta Hawks, Hoops fans are set for an electrifying clash. Both squads are facing each other on the heels of consecutive games, a factor that's bound to test their endurance and performance. The Warriors, standing at 21 wins and 24 losses, are on par with the Hawks, who have notched up 21 victories and 27 defeats. Delving into the stats and trends reveals more about what this game has in store. The Warriors are putting up an impressive 118.57 points per game, just shy of the Hawks' 120.60. But defensively, Golden State has the upper hand, conceding 118.75 points on average versus Atlanta's 123.28, showcasing a tighter defense. Field goal precision is key, with the Warriors hitting 47.10% of their shots compared to the Hawks, 46.44%. Golden State also leads in three-point accuracy, boasting a 37.69% success rate over Atlanta's 36.04%, underscoring their shooting prowess. In the rebounding department, the Warriors slightly outperform the Hawks, averaging 45.84 boards per game against 44.81. This edge could be crucial for dictating the game's tempo and snagging extra scoring chances. The Warriors also excel in assists, averaging 28.43 per game to the Hawks' 25.85, indicative of a more dynamic and unified offense. Looking at the team's recent encounters, they're tied with five wins apiece in their last ten matchups. However, the Warriors have struggled in Atlanta, clinching just one victory 
and covering the spread once in their last five visits. This seems to tilt the odds in favor of the Hawks, especially given the Warriors' road woes, with a 3-10 record straight up in their latest 13 away games and a 1-5 record against the spread in their past six games in Atlanta. Injuries are pivotal to game predictions, and the Warriors will miss key players like Chris Paul, Dario Saric, Gary Payton, and Moses Moody. The Hawks have DeAndre Hunter as a questionable start, potentially affecting their strategy if he's sidelined. The consecutive game scenario favors the Warriors, who've secured five wins in eight such contests, compared to the Hawks two in eight. Given the stats, recent form, and the back-to-back game setting, the forecast tilts towards the Golden State Warriors not just holding their own, but also overcoming the three-point spread. Their superior shooting, defensive strength, and tenacity in consecutive games give them a slight advantage. Despite the Hawks being the favorites with a three-point spread, the Warriors knack for stepping up, especially with a 4-1 against the spread record in their last five games, positions them to potentially cover the spread. To wrap it up, unless the Warriors bench Steph Curry or Clay Thompson, the betting line seems off. Yes, the Hawks are on a three-game winning streak, but their defensive play remains a weak point, and they're the league's least reliable team in covering spreads. Considering the game's dynamics, I anticipate the Golden State Warriors not only covering the spread, but possibly securing a win. Their statistical dominance in crucial game aspects, along with their record in similar situations, supports this prediction. My money is on the Golden State Warriors to beat the three-point spread. Remember to review the injury reports before placing your bets. The next today's prediction is for the game between Sacramento Kings and Chicago Bulls. Tonight's game is shaping up to be a thrilling showdown, with the Sacramento Kings rolling into Chicago to face off against the Bulls. The Kings, boasting a commendable 28-19 record, have lit up the scoreboard with an average of 118.38 points per game, reflecting their explosive offensive strategy. Meanwhile, the Bulls, with a 23-26 tally, have played a more strategic game, averaging 110.85 points per game. Digging into the stats, the Kings outshine with their shooting efficiency, hitting 47.97% from the field and 37.15% from beyond the arc, surpassing the Bulls 46.39% and 35.66% respectively. The Kings also have a slight edge in rebounding, pulling down 43.58 boards a game to the Bulls 43.21. On defense, the Bulls have been tighter, conceding fewer points, 112.46, compared to the Kings 117.47, a factor that could be pivotal tonight. Historically, the Kings have had the upper hand in Chicago, securing wins and beating the spread in three of their last five visits. Their recent form, with a 5-1 to record in their last six games and a strong showing against Eastern Conference teams, signals their potential to dominate again tonight. Yet, the Kings must navigate the challenge of playing back-to-back games, a hurdle they've stumbled on this season, with only two wins in six attempts. This could level the playing field, considering the physical and mental fatigue such games entail. Despite missing key players like Zach Levine, Lonzo Ball, and Patrick Williams, the Bulls have demonstrated grit, especially in covering the spread in five of their last seven games. The uncertainties around Torrey Craig and Kobe White further cloud the Bulls' prospects, yet also offer a chance for others to rise. Given the stats, recent performances, and injury impacts, Tonight's clash is expected to be fiercely competitive. The Kings' scoring ability and form position them as formidable contenders. However, the Bulls' defensive strength, home court advantage, and the Kings' back-to-back game challenge could sway the outcome in Chicago's favor. With the Bulls enjoying the benefit of rest and home support, where they've clinched 14 of their 23 victories, the scales tip towards them winning and covering the spread. The mix of home advantage, the Kings' potential fatigue, and the Bulls' defensive adaptability are likely to dictate the game's direction. Anticipate a nail-biter, with the Bulls narrowly outperforming the Kings and covering the minus 1.5-point spread. My money's on the Bulls to pull through. 
The next today's prediction is for the game between Los Angeles Lakers and New York Knicks. In the electrifying world of the NBA, an exhilarating showdown is on the horizon as the Los Angeles Lakers gear up to take on the New York Knicks in their fortress. This game is shaping up to be a dazzling display of aerial acrobatics and tactical genius. With a mixed bag of 26 wins and 25 losses, the Lakers are riding a roller coaster season. Their offensive firepower, averaging a robust 116.32 points per game, slightly edges out the Knicks' tally of 115.38. On the flip side, the Lakers have been a bit too accommodating on defense, surrendering 117.42 points per game compared to the Knicks' tighter grip, allowing only 109.29. The Knicks stand tall with a solid 32-17 record, proving to be a force to reckon with, especially on their home ground. Their defensive sharpness is further underscored by their rebounding supremacy, snagging 46.06 rebounds per game over the Lakers' 43.06, a crucial factor for dominating the game's rhythm and snagging vital second-chance points. Scrutinizing the shooting stats, the Lakers boast a superior field goal accuracy of 49.31% against the Knicks' 46.97%, showcasing their knack for securing and converting quality shots. Yet the Knicks hold a slight advantage in three-point precision at 37.40% against the Lakers' 36.36%, signaling their ability to open up the game and put the Lakers' defense to the test. Injury updates introduce an extra layer of excitement, with the Lakers potentially missing powerhouses like LeBron James, Anthony Davis, and Jared Vanderbilt. The Knicks, on the other hand, could be without Julius Randle and Mitchell Robinson, with O.G. Anunobi and Quentin Grimes in the doubtful category. These absences could significantly tilt the game's strategic balance and flow. Historical matchups in New York have always been closely fought, with the Lakers clinching victories twice in their last five outings but failing to beat the spread in any. Coupled with the Knicks' current hot streak, undefeated against the spread in their last seven outings and a 9-0 straight-up record, this paints a picture of a team in peak form, especially on their home turf. Given the Knicks' formidable home record, their defensive solidity, and the Lakers' injury woes, the forecast tips in favor of the Knicks not just to win, but also to overcome the 4.5-point spread. Their defensive dominance and rebounding control, along with consistent three-point shooting, give them the upper hand. Moreover, the Lakers struggles to beat the spread, particularly against Atlantic Division rivals and in away games, highlight the uphill battle they face. However, the total points outlook offers a more complex scenario. Considering the Lakers' propensity for high-scoring away games and the Knicks' tendency to go under, the match might pivot towards a more defense-oriented battle, especially with key players possibly out of action. Therefore, while the Knicks are tipped to triumph and cover the spread, the total points are expected to lean towards the under, reflecting both teams' defensive strengths and the influence of injuries on scoring. To wrap up, Despite the Los Angeles Lakers pulling off a surprising victory over the Celtics without Anthony Davis and LeBron James, consistency remains their Achilles heel, and they might be without their stars again. The New York Knicks, riding a wave of nine consecutive victories and a 29-18-2 record against the spread, are poised to leverage their home advantage defensive skill and rebounding edge to clinch the win and cover the spread. This clash is set to showcase the strategic depths and adaptability of both teams, with the Knicks likely to extend their remarkable streak. My prediction favors the New York Knicks to secure a win and comfortably cover the 4.5-point spread. The next today's prediction is for the game between Milwaukee Bucks and Dallas Mavericks. Tonight's showdown in Dallas has the Milwaukee Bucks squaring off against the Dallas Mavericks in a captivating battle of basketball giants. Both squads are laser-focused on clinching the win, but they're hitting the hardwood under different banners. The Bucks, with a robust 32-16 ledger, roll in as a juggernaut, while the Mavericks, sitting at 26-22, aim to capitalize on their turf to close the gap. The Bucks hit the court in full health, a key slam dunk in their favor. On the flip side, the Mavericks are in a bit of a jam with Kyrie Irving, Derek Jones Jr., and Derek Lively all tagged as questionable and Dante Exum riding the bench. This shuffle could throw a wrench in their game plan and bench depth. By the numbers, the Bucks have the edge, dropping an average of 123.88 points per game over the Mavericks' 
and narrowly outperforming them on defense. This offensive dynamism, paired with a defense that's neck and neck, primes us for a scoreboard lighting showdown. The Bucks also take the lead in shooting precision, hitting the net at 49.66% against the Mavericks 47.39%, and outmatch them beyond the arc with a 37.78% success rate. Their rebounding and assists game further paints them as a more unified and potent offensive force. Looking at recent face-offs, the Bucks have dominated three out of the last five in Dallas. Yet, their road game betting trends have been shaky, failing to cover the spread in their last eight away games. The Mavericks, despite their struggles, including a 1-6 record against the spread in recent matches, have kept it tight against the Bucks at home, hinting at their potential to beat the spread, especially with a five-point head start. Factoring in the Bucks' statistical superiority against the Mavericks' home court hustle and the uncertainty around key players due to injuries, we're set for a thrilling clash. The Bucks' shooting prowess and clean bill of health make them the favorites in a straight-up battle. But when it comes to covering the spread, the Mavericks might have the upper hand, thanks to their resilience at home and the Bucks' recent road woes. With Dallas rallying behind their crowd and the possibility of keeping the contest within a five-point margin, they're positioned well to cover. Anticipating a high-octane scoring spree with a total points line at 249.5, both teams are likely to push the pace, potentially tipping the score over the threshold. Wrapping up, the Mavericks might miss Kyrie, but having Luka in the mix is a game-changer. The Bucks have been off their defensive game, struggling to string together wins, and their spread-covering stats are less than stellar. With Luka's firepower, the Mavericks are poised to possibly snag this win. Betting on Dallas to cover the five-point spread feels like a savvy move for a match that promises to keep fans on the edge of their seats. The last prediction for today is for the matchup between Cleveland Cavaliers and San Antonio Spurs. Tonight's showdown features the Cleveland Cavaliers boasting a commendable 30-16 record as they hit the road to take on the San Antonio Spurs. The Spurs are in the midst of a tough season, holding a 10-39 record, setting the stage for an intriguing clash. The Cavaliers bring a powerhouse of defense and sharpshooting to the court, averaging 114-40 points per game while limiting their opponents to 110.04 points. Their field goal percentage is stellar at 47.88%, with a solid 35.79% from three-point land. Dominating the boards, they snag an average of 44.84 rebounds per game, highlighting their control over the game's flow. On the flip side, the Spurs, despite facing hurdles, pack a punch with an average of 112.56 points at a 46.20% shooting accuracy and 42.98 rebounds per game. Their three-point accuracy, though slightly lower at 34.46%, remains a lurking threat. Injury reports add a twist to tonight's narrative. The Cavaliers might miss Jarrett Allen's defensive prowess, along with Tristan Thompson and Ty Jerome. The Spurs will feel the absence of Keldon Johnson, affecting their scoring diversity. These injuries could shift the game's balance, influencing tactics and outcomes. Historically, the Cavaliers have outperformed the Spurs in recent matchups, especially in San Antonio, securing wins and beating the spread in three of their last four visits. Their current run, 12-1 straight up in the last 13 games, and a 7-3 record against the spread in their last 10, indicates a strong momentum. The Spurs, however, face an uphill battle, especially on the second night of a back-to-back, -back where they've only clinched two victories this season, showing a 3-9 straight-up record in their last 12 games. Yet the Spurs' knack for beating the spread, particularly with a more than 10-point buffer, is noteworthy. Their 12-5 record against the spread in the last 17 games, under Coach Popovich's strategic guidance, showcases their grit. Additionally, matchups in San Antonio tend to be high-scoring affairs, with the total going over in the last six meetings, promising an action-packed game. Considering the stats, injury reports, and past performances, tonight's game is expected to be closely contested. The Cavaliers, with their superior record and stats, will face a tough opponent in the Spurs on their home turf, who have a history of overcoming odds. In summary, while the Cleveland Cavaliers are in a prime position to extend their winning streak, they now enjoy a rest advantage. This explains the favorable spread. However, the Spurs, with their relentless determination, have been competitive, covering the spread in six of their last nine games 
and narrowly missing a win against the Pelicans as eight-point underdogs. Last month, they gave the Cavaliers a run for their money. Although the Cavaliers are the favorites to win, tonight's game leans towards the San Antonio Spurs to cover the ten-point spread, suggesting a game that will be closer than the standings imply.